Taken away, here's a chance for Nick Jones. Jones coming in alone for Buffalo, he shoots and Coyne comes up with a huge save. The physical presence spins, shot, nice save by Coyne. Back comes Stern, Stern carrying it in, all alone is Hughes, and Coyne able to snag it. Up goes Dangerous, quick wrist shot, rebound, shoots, oh, sliding over to big save, turned in by Coyne. James Hughes, Hughes really can wheel, Hughes right to the net, pad save, rebound, jabbed at, and Coyne makes another stop, comes out high, and a great save by Coyne. Look out, putting on the break, shot, deflection, oh, oh nice save there by Coyne. Bukestead turns and fires, and a blocker save there by Coyne. And to the net, here's a pass in front, shoots, oh, oh. what a save there. Two on one, back the other way in front. Coin is there. Did it work its way in? No, it didn't. The left wing comes free for Buffalo. A nice pass across to Becker and a big save by Coin. Grove will win this one by a score of three to two to advance to that championship game against Blaine. We will come back to hear from the Happy Crimson in just a moment. Here, your final again is Maple Grove three and Centennial two. Crimson players Kyle and Ryan Coyne are hoping to enjoy this final season of playing together. They are, first of all, brothers, and Ryan and Kyle Coyne love to compete. Kyle is a senior defenseman for the Crimson, Ryan a junior goalie, together trying to help a young Maple Grove team improve. <laughs> Ryan played mostly junior varsity last season, but is the Crimson's top varsity goalie this winter. He worked hard in the offseason improving his game. I did multiple programs this year. I did a program called Fit and Blaine. I worked with several goalie coaches, Justin Johnson, Pisa Margia. My college hockey is definitely something I'm trying to pursue. You know, you never know what's going to happen, but I want to try to get, like, try to take uh, advantage of every opportunity that I can to try to get there. We've been watching Ryan through the Bantam ranks, Pee Wee ranks, and uh, he had a great year last year in the JV team, and, and we knew with, uh, with both uh, Sean and, and Brandon leaving us uh, for graduation, uh, we had to have someone step in, and uh, he's done that so far. While Kyle's high school career winds down, 
Ryan still has almost two full seasons left in a crimson jersey. And his big brother is looking forward to watching. I think he has the potential to be great and hopefully he can play juniors and then hopefully, like he said, his goal was to play Division One hockey. I love playing hockey each and every day. Like I, It doesn't get boring to me at all. And I just think that I, I think that's a sport I could excel in most, and that's why I chose him. These guys do pretty well in the classroom as well. Both Ryan and Kyle are honor roll students.